Well, that has to be the longest update I've ever been postponing. It's just that I don't really like when the developers make content not available right away. Of course, I can ask for an instant access because I'm a YouTuber, but I'm not that person and I never will be. Essentially, Desolation is like a new whole world and you can only access it by defeating Anakin and there's gonna be like two portals, one continuing the main storyline and then this side arc. I think I still remember the cheese tactic for him, which is essentially just explosive arrows and just detonate his ass. The thing is that I can't really think because the monks will just overrun me so this is gonna be just real fast real quick action. <laughs> Let's just see. Wait, let me turn my microphone because from this craziness it just went flying. But yeah, real and simple Gouda. <laughs> hmm, something's different. <laughs> Wait, it's Paradise Lost. No, what the hell? How do we access Desolation then? Players still need to overcome the same Gatekeeper Anakin, perhaps choosing different way and different challenges to get there. I'm kinda confused, <laughs> not gonna lie. It says we have to hunt down a mysterious bat inside Purgatory. I didn't find anything though. Maybe for the second time around? I don't know, let me see. I don't think I'm gonna be killing everyone though, like... I think the bat would be somewhere on the building, no? Get out from my face! <laughs> I need a bat! And now I'll be luring everyone. I want the child. Wait, why is he flying? <laughs> I think he disappeared, right? Whatever. <laughs> well, we have one problem. I didn't get explosive arrows. I don't know how I'm gonna do the Anakin without it. Oh, wait. <gasps> there it is. Um, should I go close by or just snipe? I really want to go close by and then just fastly. Yes. Gotta be! Or maybe I had to defeat Anakin again and then return and then this bat would appear. Let's go to the actual update. Wow. Dark and mysterious. Oh wow. This is a little bit different. <laughs> Let's just say that. I guess those bats now <laughs> will attack us. Oh my god, move normally. So this is like a scimitar themed, yeah. Though there's like an open space, so I like that. I hate like shooting in small rooms. Like that's when the archery actually starts for me. Oh, that's a bigger one, what the hell? I just noticed, I thought it's the small one. Oof, okay, that's uh, that's a lot. Do we go down or up? Let's go down.
Well, it's not that bad. I could use some heal. <laughs> Oh, rafts. <laughs> I just noticed. Yes, I see you going down. I like that they stop before attacking you, then you can really make your shot. I wonder what's gonna be the boss in this area. This is like a side story, so... I know that I didn't pass Paradise Lost, but that's just due to not playing. I love the ambience though. It seems like a rotten purgatory, I guess. It's huge. For some reason I don't see myself dying in this game anymore. I actually didn't lost once since I've been kind of working on this update. Maybe it's because of just smooth local and stuff. The game is just a thousand times easier for me because I'm a natural... Wow, dude. <laughs> Almost one shotting them. Couple more achievements and it's gonna be piece of what the hell? Oh <laughs> Oh They're not attacking me directly, see? That's what I'm saying about the smooth loco, like it kinda breaks the mechanics. Normally you would be just standing in one place, but because you move and shoot at the same time The game is just much easier I don't know where to go, I guess that direction Oh my god. Nah. Ow. Stupid bats. <laughs> What the fuck? Okay, with you? I'm doing the explosives. We can go down? Why? What the hell? Hey, what's going on? <laughs> Do 
we care to find out? Like, that was so weird. Is this like a totem or something? Hello? This is just pure horror to me. Oh, it's like a shaman. Okay. Cool. What's there? Oh wow. Oh fuck you. <laughs> huh? Oh, it's just random. <laughs> <laughs> Outsmarted. I kinda want to go away from here. Exit, please. Oh. Okay. I guess we push through up until we meet a boss or something now. Well, I did not like that sound, <laughs> but I know it's coming. I definitely like that tactic. <laughs> Damn, my aim. <laughs> Calm down. Here we go. Can you not? Yeah, this is gonna be a boss area. Don't jump! <laughs> I'm better in the field.
Oops, not here. <laughs> Hell. I hate this. This is so easily jump scary potential for me. Let's lure the first group. Not that bad. I'm like a gargoyle just traveling on the pillars. <laughs> I actually did not try ever this arrow. Ricocheting explosion. Whoa! <laughs> you! <laughs> I took shots from the walls. I fought from the enemies though. Let's just go. Ah. Sudden. Mate, this is my spot. <laughs> wait, wait, calm down. First archers. I'll try that. Oh, that's shit, actually. I did not like that at all. Like I'm saying, I'm, it's just weird to die now. Like there's so many kind of options not to do it. I'll eat my words, I guess. <laughs> I think by just falling down.
say what now? <laughs> no surprises. Fuck off. <laughs> To Anakin? Wait, how? Is it because there has to be a continuity in boss fights but not necessarily in the stages? <laughs> this is gonna be a repeat. Is he stronger? <laughs> Gouda, again. <laughs> and we're again in Paradise Lost. So essentially this is just like a loophole. Well, I definitely enjoyed this update. It's so interesting that it's like a side level, but then we're continuing like the usual schedule with the bosses and stuff. I'm not entirely sure why I'm not like doing a full playthrough of in-depth. Maybe because of the roguelike nature and just being uncertain that some footage might just be useless if I'll die in the level. My opinion doesn't really change. Like I enjoyed in-depth before, I enjoy it now. This game for like an an archery enthusiast is just amazing. Nah! <laughs> That's what I'm not playing. It's just horror. <laughs>